In this series of videos I've been attempting to repair this PDP 1134A vintage computer. I've worked through quite a number of faults. I've had about 40 faults so far, um, all varying from uh, failed ICs through to broken tracks and problems with the backplane. Um, there are still some faults I know about that I need to resolve but it's got to the point where it's starting to boot from floppy drive so I thought we'd have a bit of fun in this video no repairs in this video but I'm just going to see if this can actually run any software and uh, if it can play any simple games I'm not going to go into too much, much depth in this video with regards to software I will come back to software in later videos but for this one it's just some very basic uh, testing to see if it's capable of actually running anything other than just the uh, command prompt so what we'll do is we'll switch to the console and um, see what we can do. We'll boot to RT11 and try running some uh, simple games. So we'll start by booting up. I'll reboot the PDP and now we'll try booting from the floppy disk. I've got the boot uh, floppy inserted and we'll see if it boots up. So as you can see it seems to be able to boot up from floppy and it can read the uh, contents on the floppy disk. So uh, as you can probably see there is a game on there so we'll try starting that up and see how it goes. Okay, just kidding, that's uh, obviously not really running on the PDP, uh, but this is the actual game that's running. So as you can see the PDP is coming back to life, got some uh, work to do on it yet and um, hopefully uh, before too much longer it will be a fully functional machine. Uh, once I've got it fully assembled, um, put back together, properly tested, uh, we'll start looking into the various bits of software that are available and uh, see if we can uh, make more use of it. <laughs> 